Okay, and then moving around towards the back, um, you can see how the hair grows here. He and Munch both kind of have light stripes right here and that. So this is the side that I did already over here. This one I'm going to even up a little bit. It's a little bit long right there. So um, I just comb it and then hold it out. Hold in, my other hand is holding the skin securely. And then you pull down with the tool. He has a pretty sensitive rump, so I'm um, pretty careful with him. You just want to take a couple hairs out at a time. Okay, and now to get the poofy buns part. Um, once you have this part even, then I like to comb this together. And you can see and hold it, and then you can see the long hairs right there. We're just going to take those out into the shape of a half moon. And then that also cleans up right around um, their bottom, so there's no hairs, no hairs for the poop to collect on. Okay, and so then that's the shape of it. You get a little bit of a puppy puffiness, and then this rounded shape here going down into the legs. Okay, and now moving into. Um, the rump shape right here. I'm going to I'm going to um trim this up a little bit. And so like I demonstrated with um Pam in the other video, you just comb it to the center, clamp it together, and then you'll want to work into a half moon shape. And he doesn't want to hold his tail up. And again, the boys are pretty sensitive back here with their boy parts. Um, so I like to be pretty gentle, gentle and careful with all of that business going on. So I just took out um, just a little bit down this column, this line. He needs a little bit more length taken out maybe down here. It's okay. And you want this back side, I'm going to bring it around here to the very back of him. Hopefully you can see. But um, this back side goes into this cleft of their leg right there. So that's about the length I'm going for. Is so that it falls into that natural groove there. Stan. I switched out for Munch and... Um, you can see that where I was talking about the length hitting this um, divot in their leg because she's light back here and so it sort of shows up a little bit more. Um, but that's what you're looking for in the length in this on their bottom where it hits just into that backside of that curve of their knee.